Delroy Denton, his street name was Epsi, has served time in a Jamaican prison for firearms violations and armed robbery. Police intelligence reports described him as a murderous participant in street wars. The founder of a Kingston gang known as the Rapid Posse, Denton gained entry into Britain in 1993 or 1994 under a false name. In May 1994, he was arrested during a police raid of Brixton's Atlantic pub. He was charged with intent to distribute and possession of an offensive weapon. Facing deportation, Denton applied for political asylum, claiming his life was in danger from corrupt politicians in Jamaica. After being approached by Brian Fotheringham and Steve Barker, Denton agreed to become a police informer against Jamaican criminals known as Yardies. He was paid £50 a week and registered as an informant with the Home Office. Although immigration officials reported Delroy to be a dangerous Jamaican criminal, given 16 years in Jamaica for firearms aggravated burglary offences, who had fled Jamaica and was wanted for the murders of seven women, he was allowed to remain in the country and released from custody within three days. While in the service of SO11, the Criminal Intelligence Division of Scotland Yard, Denton committed several violent crimes, including the sexual assault of a 15-year-old schoolgirl on the 19th of December 1994. But on the 1st of February 1995, the rape charge was dropped due to lack of evidence. The following April, Denton stabbed 24-year-old trainee beautician Marcia Laws 18 times after breaking into a Brixton residence and sexually assaulting her. Although initially arrested by police on the 28th of June, he was released due to lack of evidence on the 1st of November 1995. During the investigation into the murder of Laws, detectives informed Fotheringham of Denton's immigration status. However, he took no action. Barker's superiors were then contacted and Denton was taken off the list of registered informers, but Barker continued to meet with him. However, because of the protests of senior officials, Denton would later be retried and convicted of Law's murder, for which he was sentenced to life imprisonment in July 1996. When he was tried for Miss Law's murder, he was described as a Premier League danger to the public and a sex fueled psychopath. His later appeal to the House of Lords on the grounds that his status as a police informer was not divulged to his defence team was declined.